Hello and welcome back to another episode of the Final Fantasy VI LLG Blindfolded. Um, in this episode I'll be taking out Rhizopaz. I, I was debating about whether to include the Mobilis stuff in this segment, but I decided against it. Alright, I arranged my item inventory there because, uh... I want to make it so that when I go and de-equip Shadow's Relics, Skills Equipped Relic, uh, they'll end up right at the bottom for easy re-equipping. Specifically for the Hyper Wrist. Um... Fortunately, this battle's easy enough that if I do mess up this re-equipping segment, there's still a te pretty decent chance I'll win. It's not really that critical. And finally, Cyan and Sabin go in the back row, and yeah, that's it for all the de-equipping and re-equipping I need to do. Oh yeah, right, no it isn't. Um, skills equip. Or not. Did I go in the config menu somehow? Yeah, that must be the config menu, because I heard that pause in the middle. Not sure what happened there, but save, item, skills, equip. Alright, now Shadow's hopefully been emptied. Up, right, up, right, up, right, up, right, up, right. Unfortunately, it doesn't give me an indication of whether when I've entered this little spot here, which is kind of annoying. Fortunately, I... It doesn't matter if I whether I'm go the transition throws me off because I'll end up in the same place whether I start with a button press of up or this button press of right when I enter the place. So I should be in here by now, and it really doesn't matter too much because I I. What was I gonna say again? Alright, so first I get this uh, cutscene where Shadow leaves. So I'm just gonna use the menu trick to find when this is over. There we go, it's over now. And into the waterfall. Yeah, so if I fail to de-equip Shadow properly, I may have to end up restarting this segment. So really this battle is actually on a timer. It makes it look like you have to just kill a bunch of uh, piranhas before you uh, trigger the next stage of the, the fight. But really you have to wait a while and then kill one set of piranhas. And that will do it just as easily. And this gives me the luxury of just sitting there and defending instead of wasting my time hitting piranhas. Waiting through this takes just as long as waiting through a cutscene, really, so it's not much different from that. Except I don't really know when it's over, because I don't really know when the exact moment of the 60 second mark passing, but... Or whatever it is. I think the timer on this is 60. Alright, I believe it's been three attacks from the Piranhas. I'll wait for a fourth and then I'll go for it. Alright. Time to use the last tonics I have in my inventory. now just to hit the things. Seven go went first there, which is nice because he does more damage to the Rhizopaz, so I'd prefer to have him go first on that. Rhizopaz dies in just three hits, so every turn counts, but 
El Nino can be dangerous. Oh, he didn't die this time in three hits. Makes me wonder if I didn't equip the Atlas Armlet properly or if it was just damage variation. Alright, so that other guy left the room now, so I'll talk a little bit louder. The worst part is that I don't even know if I de-equipped Shadow properly until the end of the segment. That ninja gear is pretty nice, so I kinda want it. The plumed hat is... meh. His shield was meh. And his weapon can only be equipped by him, so I don't really care. Even though it's not really that meh. It's just that ninja gear that I kinda wanna keep. However, in hindsight, it's not really a disaster if uh, it le gets left behind, but... Oh yeah, right. I'm gonna get a naming screen, so I shouldn't be doing the menu trick here. Not to mention I can just run straight out, so I don't need the menu trick anyway. Alright then, so I shall be crossing the veld here, but not yet, because I haven't planned it out, so it would probably be a disaster if I tried. In hindsight though, maybe I could just start walking, end up somewhere else, and I'd probably end up with a more favorable way to walk to Mobles. Or I could die, that could happen too. Let's take a few steps. Oh great. Oh no, it's, it's it's soldiers and I was hoping for not this battle. At least I'm assuming it's soldiers, it could be something else. Oh, it's probably a uh, commander and dogs. Yep, it's definitely commander and dogs. I thought the battle would be over there. Alright, so let's keep walking down and right a little bit. Alright, my goal is to hopefully maybe end up where, somewhere that I, uh... Am I on the item command? Somewhere that I can just walk up and right to Mobiles, because that would be the most convenient. But uh, that's just complete guesswork, really. Well, that's not what I meant to do. So I'm probably... Oh yeah, I'm probably on skills. Um, item... Yeah, there we go. Alright, segment over. Maybe. I don't know. I can't really tell.